Hello everyone, welcome back to Motorbike Garage Mechanic Simulator. Motorbike Mechanic Garage Simulator? Uh, I'm not sure. Either way, when we left off our last episode, this beautiful green uh, chopper right here uh, needed a battery on it. And I think I looked this motor up and down and all around and I could not find a battery for it. Uh, I didn't have a clue where the battery was until just now. I did this. There's a battery cover. This big thing on the side right here. Battery cover. That thing. Right there. Um, so, so we found the battery. And there's one little screw to take off. Uh, we need to be in disassembly mode, I guess. There we go. Battery cover. Battery. I'll tell you, oh, I gotta unhook the cables. Oh, there's a little screw right there on that one. Alright, screw. Battery cable. Battery ca cable. There we go. Battery. This part is too damaged to use again. Okay. Do that. Battery. B100. Perfect. Cool. And then we have a cable and a screw. Cable and a screw. Cover and a screw. Nice. Now, that was way more difficult than it should have been. Let's check and see what else we have here. Uh, I don't remember which one we were working on this one. Uh, alternator. New part. Alternator. Okay. Uh, let's go find the alternator on this rig now. Um... I'm assuming since the battery's here and the foot starter is there. Uh, alternator cover. There we go. Let's see, it had to be on this side somewhere. So we're going to have to take off a bunch of this stuff here, it looks like. Let's see. We got screws. Go ahead and pull that thing off. I don't know where the... I don't know where the uh, screws are for this thing. Um, lamp? No. We need to get this off. So let's see if this will work. If we have to, gonna, if we're gonna have to take this arm out of the way right here, we're gonna have to do that. Then we're probably gonna have to take off something somewhere else. Uh, as a non-mechanic, this is very interesting to me. Uh, so this is the alternator. We're gonna take that screw out and take that alternator out. There we go. Now let's go into assembly mode. We'll put a new alternator in. Alternator, alternator, perfect. There we go. Cover and put a whole bunch of screws back in. Like a NASCAR pit crew here. We'll put that guy back on. And that should be it. We should be done. I think. Should be done. Uh, finally. Yeah, I was sitting here looking around. I was like, man, I got to find this thing somewhere. Okay, so alternator, battery, uh, clutch, brake disc, uh, fuel filter, spark plug. Done. Finish. Other cycle doesn't have all the parts attached. What do we... What are we missing? What did I accidentally take off this thing? In this mode, you can see all the parts that need to be attached to complete the motorbike. Okay. Oh. Screws. Ignition ends. Some screws over here. Okay, well, let's start on this side. All right. So here and here. There and there, okay. This one. Right here. I didn't know this thing was, uh, I didn't know this was a thing. Could have, uh, done this a long time ago, I guess. I feel like that's kind of cheaty, but there's so many little screws that I missed. Uh, let's go back to assembly mode. Nope. It's gonna be that. It's gonna be some, some, uh, screws here somewhere. Like right there. Here and here. You guys see anything else? This is simple part zero. Cool. Now we're ready to turn this in. Uh, that was exhausting, honestly. I mean, that was just a lot of work. Money. 2012. Uh, $2,012. Nice. How to get paid for this task? Uh, you need to preserve 
the colors clients color of the clients motorbike but I did that hmm oh well not accepted uh, which which four animals does a woman like to have in her house Yeah, we're going to decline that one. Uh, let's see what this one is. Foot starter lever, new part. Fuel filter, hand grips, rear brake, ornament. Um, let's got some different stuff on it. Let's check this one out. We've accepted this. Okay, cool. We're going to go over here. And we're going to check out eBuy first. See if we have anything to sell for one. Mirrors, yes, we'll sell those. Oh, cool. buy. Okay. We'll need to uh, we'll need to have a foot starter lever. Foot starter lever? Nope. Okay, no foot starter level in uh, lever in there. Fuel filter. Fuel filter. Uh, that's the FF nine one one. This is the FF seven one one. So that's not gonna work. Hand grips. H eight one nine. This is H one one nine. So that's not gonna work. Ornament, no ornaments. Rear brake. There's a rear brake in here. Uh, RB725, yes. RB725 it is, uh, wherever it went. Cool. We're going to buy that for $186. That may have just saved us some money. Check out uh, Frozen Monkey and see if it saved us any money. Uh, rear brake. Uh, 725, I believe it was. 249 it did. It saved us about 50 bucks or more. 60 bucks. All right, now we need a footer start, uh, foot starter lever. That's that's hard to say. A foot starter lever. Yes, that thing. Uh, let's see, where would it be? Foot, foot starter lever. And we need uh, FSL 314. FSL 314. Buy that. How much that cost us? $49. That's not bad. Uh, fuel filter, FF711. Fuel filter. FF711, that's going to cost us $89, not too bad. Uh, hand grips, H119. Hand grips, H119. Uh, yep, $129. It's funny, the stuff that costs more is the stuff that's the, uh, um, what's it? What's the word for it? The decorative stuff, ornament. Need an ornament, or ornament. There we go. Uh, which one is it? Uh, 0423. 0423. Nice. Good call. $79. All right. Parts needed for task none. We should be good. Uh, escape. Out of that. Oh, look at this thing. Got that candy paint on it. Let's put this thing on the uh, on the rack and then go see what parts need painted, if any. Uh, foot starter lever. Um, required color. Current color. Uh, confirm color, color changes. No. I want to auto. There we go. Confirm color changes. Perfect. Other parts. No. Escape. Try this again. Fuel filter. Fired color. Color match auto. Confirm changes. Okay. Uh, hand grips. Fired color. They're good. Ornament. Fired color is this one. So we're going to go that color. Go confirm changes. Good. And rear brake. I'm pretty sure the color is not going to be changed on it. Oh, I don't know. There we go. Uh, now we should be good. Should be. I know the ornament is uh, right here. Let's go into disassembly mode. There is a screw right there somewhere. Uh, going somewhere else. Uh huh, right there. Remove that. Okay. Put that one back on. Put that back in. Put that back in. Boy, that's wild looking right there. All right, cool. That's done. Now what do we need? Uh, assembly preview. Oh, that's a lot of stuff to take off there. I don't think I need to take all that off. Let's go to disassemble mode. And we need to take off a foot brake lever. Know that for sure. 
We just have to figure out where we take it off at. See. Put starter lever. Put brake lever. Okay. Is there a screw right here somewhere? Take that out. Will that work? Is it behind it? Hmm. Take this off. No? Put on that side of it? Gearbox. You know what? I've made a complete train wreck of this thing. Let's, uh... Let's get out of that. And, uh... See if we can just turn that back into the owner. Okay, that's yeah, fine. We're gonna we're gonna accept this one. Uh, alternator, battery, clutch, brake disc, fuel filter, and spark plugs. We can handle that. Holy moly! So uh, let's take this one off of the thing. Um, put this one on there. Yeah, this is a much better looking bike anyway. That one's stupid. <laughs> uh, I don't really know what what to do there. I couldn't get the brake lever off. So, Eba. What do we need for it? Alternator. Okay, let's go to buy. No alternator, right off the bat. Okay, spark plugs. No spark plugs. Rear brake disc RBD526. Rear brake disc. Let's see if it's not a brake disc. Nope. Front brake disc. F front wheel, front starter, uh, front starter lever. Nope. Okay. So none of the things I need are in you buy. Got it. Sale. Oh, we can sell all this stuff. Eh, I don't think we're going to though, because we'll end up having to pay for that somehow, and pay for it back, buy it back or something. Let's not do that. Parts needed for task. Uh, alternator. Okay. Three forty nine. Oh my goodness. Uh, front brake disc. Probably do that. Uh, front. Front. Uh, let's see. Battery. Front brake lever. Foot rest. Front brake disc. There we go. Uh, FD, FBD 509. FBD 509. Cool. What's the price on that? 399 Good gracious, this is expensive. Uh, rear brake disc. Uh, R, RBD 526. Okay, RBD 526. That one right there. 399 this job is not even going to cover the uh, the parts. Uh, spark plugs. Okay, we can probably do spark plugs. They are only nine dollars. Perfect. Okay. Now I think we have our our task, everything we need. Uh, I don't think the brake discs are going to have to be a certain color. Uh, let's see what we have to do here again. I can't remember alternator. All right, alternator, battery, clutch. Oh, we need to buy a battery. Or did we buy a battery? Parts needed. Nothing. Okay. All right. Cool. Go into work mode. And we'll go into disassemble mode. We'll start with the battery and alternator since we know how to do those. Now, after some work, uh, screw. Get a little closer look here. Cable. Screw. Cable. Battery. Uh, assembly mode. Then we're gonna go battery. E300. Yep. Perfect. Uh, cables. Screws. Cover, screw, cool. Alternator, we go to disassembly mode and go screws all the way around. Pull that off just to be out of our way there. Pull that out, screw, alternator. Okay, assembly mode, alternator, perfect. Screw, cover, screws back in. Getting pretty good at this. We figure out how to take a front brake lever off. We're gonna be good. Uh, what else did we have? Uh, brake disc, brake disc on and off. There we go. Uh, let's see. I don't think that thing comes off there like that. We're probably gonna have to take a bunch of the stuff apart here. Uh, let's just try it this way. There's a brake disc. So let's try this. Yeah. 
Yeah, I didn't figure that was happening. Hmm. So take that off. I'm gonna have to take a whole bunch of stuff loose. Loose. Wait a minute. Maybe it's this. Maybe it's this is holding us up. There's a screw in this thing somewhere, right? Should be. Yep, right there. Right there. Oh, we'll take that off. Nope. Rear brake disc. It's still not coming off there. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, let's see. Take the chain off. Uh, I think we're gonna have to take that whole deal off there. Gonna have to take this whole thing off again? Really not. Take the chain off of it, probably. But that's the way it's looking. We're gonna have to take this whole thing apart again. Okay, drive guard, and there should be. Um, shouldn't be anything holding the front drive guard, right? Uh, maybe it was this. No. Get all the screws. I think I did. I think I got them all. Okay, I did. Go ahead and just take those off for good measure. Nope, that's not it. I think there's some in the bottom of this thing somewhere. The back side, maybe. Uh. Whatever that's doing. That off. Uh-huh. Drive guard still on. Uh-huh. Right there. Drive guard still won't come off. Okay. I think I have cleaned this thing out of screws on this end. Uh, so it's going to be something down here, right? Not those two, that's for the filter. Uh, oh, there we go, drive guard, chain. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Uh, took that off. Gonna take this loose. Uh, something on this side? There shouldn't be anything holding it. Unless I gotta take the fender off. Go ahead and take the fender off. Okay. Uh, let's attach that. Rear fender. Okay. Probably means we need to take this off. Okay. Probably need to take the seat off. So that's underneath. I think is what I remember. Seat. Gone. Fender. Nope, right here. Gone? Nope. Uh, take that off. There's something else holding the fender right down here. Looks like it. One underneath? No? Nope, okay. Nothing there. This thing? Right there. Found it. Uh-huh. Well, this is a disassemble job right here. Holy moly. Cool. Part cannot be used anymore. Got it. Assembly mode. This, this is going to be a task, putting this thing back together. That back on. Let's go ahead and put all our screws back in here. Um, I think that's it there. Before we do anything else, let's put this guy back on. Oh, boy. Which one was it? Uh, I don't remember. It wasn't that one. That one. Okay, cool. Uh, screw there. Screw there. No other screws for that. Alright. Now then. Uh, put the chain back on. Okay, gearbox. Screws back in this. Uh, that one. I need to go get rid of some of these parts after this job. Starting to stack them up. Actually, no. One of these go to the other bike, don't they? 
Yeah. Yeah, so it's gonna be hard to get rid of parts unless we just scrap that whole bike over there. I think we might do that. Because I just have no idea where the, uh, where the stinking foot brake lever thing is for that bike. Probably just gonna scrap the whole bike. We'll sell all the parts, make all the money we can off of it. Uh, turn this into Deuce's Chop Shop. Uh, probably bad for everybody involved because, well, I don't know what I'm doing, so. All right, anything else? Yep, right there. I see you. No? No other screws? For the filter. I think that's it. Let's, uh, let's see. Assembly mode. Nope, I missed one right there. Okay. Right there it is. Assembly preview. I don't even know where that's at. What is that? Oh, that's the foot peg. Okay. The remote. We'll put that back on. Uh, assembly mode preview. Okay. Let's uh, start with this. Let's put the, actually all that back on. It is. Let's put these lines back on right here. Okay. There's one. Brake line. Pretty sure that goes to here. Already on. It's an oil pipe. Okay. All right. That looks to be it for that one. Now we can put this back on. Oh no, we need to put the fender back on. It's got to go on first. Rear fender. Looks like there's some bolts here. And uh, no, I don't want that. I want that. And why does the seat have to get in the way? That one, and let's see if I can just bump up just a little bit here. That one, it's got that. These two, uh, put that back on. This has been an absolute task, I'm not gonna lie. Holy moly, man. All right, that seat, be two screws underneath it. Right here and right here, cool. Uh, assembly mode, assembly preview. All right, that should be it right there. That's task complete for that one. Uh, let's go see what else we need to do. There's a, sure there's a bunch. Let's see. Uh, let's view that. Uh, clutch. Which we can do. I think we should have left the... Uh, the guard off. We should check that first. Um, we need to put the front, front brake disc on. Fuel filter. And spark plugs. Cool. Uh, fuel filter is... Uh, just right here, I think, and there are a couple of screws. That should be the fuel filter. Cool. Assembly mode. Put that one back on. Oh, no, that's not it. Okay. What did I say the fuel filter was? Under the gas tank? Gotta be right here somewhere, right? Horn. Okay, that's not it. Engine. Mm. Alternator cover. No. Filter. That's it. Oil tank. It's got to be the fuel filter. Alternator cover. Battery. Oh, we need to change the battery, don't we? No, we started with the battery. Uh, fuel filter. What is that? It's oil tank. Ignition coal. Spark plugs. Do we need to do spark plugs? No idea. Spark plugs. Uh, yes, yeah, spark plugs. We'll do spark plugs then. Uh, let's see. Disassembly mode. We're gonna take that, uh, that, this. Get in just a bit closer here. There we go. These two. Spark plugs out. Assembly mode. Spark plugs in. There we go. Spark plugs in. 
So we'll put these on. That back on. Carburetor, I mean, uh, spark plugs are done. All right, brake disc clutch. Uh, I think the clutch is going to have to go... Yeah, the fuel filter. i got to find the fuel filter. We're going to do all this in the next episode, there, though. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, me fumbling around on a motorcycle because I don't know where things are. Uh, we need to find a fuel filter. As soon as we find the fuel filter, the clutch is going to be right here under this, I think. Or is it on this side? Uh, I think it's on the other side. Uh, or is it this? I think it's this right here. I think this is the clutch. We'll see. Uh, either way, I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, leave a like, subscribe, check out more of my videos. I do plenty of simulator videos for everybody to enjoy. Uh, if you don't like it, leave me a comment. Let me know why. Is it because I'm a bad mechanic? Boring? Probably. Uh, because I'm a bad mechanic, I don't know much about the game, and I don't know much about mechanicking. So, uh, either way, we'll see you guys in the next one. I appreciate everybody watching. Uh, tomorrow, back to... Um, actually, tomorrow I may not be able to stream if you're watching this on Sunday. Uh, I may not be able to stream tomorrow. I may have to go back to work uh, one more day, and we'll stream some on Tuesday. So... Uh, keep an eye out. I'll let you know for sure. I'll see you guys in the next one. Later, everybody.